When using a router or a CNC, your choice of bit can make a huge difference. These cuts here are being made with an upcut bit. This style of bit is going to throw the wood chips and the sawdust upward, which makes it easier for the dust collector to grab that material and get it away from your cutting surface. I prefer an upcut bit for DF because I want that dust up in the dust collection boot instead of out in my shop and in my lungs. But there is a downside. That upcut bit leaves a bunch of fuzz, and you've got to come back later and clean that with some sandpaper. You've got to decide for yourself if the improved dust collection is worth the extra trouble. But when cutting with plywood, that upcut bit causes a big problem. You can see here that when you cut along the grain of that outer veneer of the plywood, the upcut bit produces these long wooden hairs. These hairs are going to clog up the dust collection boot and cause a great deal of mayhem. Here's what happens when you switch to a downcut bit. The dust collector still does a pretty good job of removing the sawdust, but there is some extra sawdust that doesn't get sucked up. And some sawdust is going to get left behind in your cut path. When you make the next path, that end mill is going to come into contact with the sawdust down in the channel from the previous paths. And that's going to cause the bit to get duller faster. But you don't get those long wooden hairs that clog up the dust boot. So I have found that it's better to use a downcut bit when working with plywood. You can check out all these bits down below the video.